Hello. So we're back and this time we have a nice package here. Now, before we are starting with the repair, I got a package from uh, France, I believe. And uh, not sure ca ca Candel means candies. It is possible to be uh, a candy package from Hugo. Yeah. So let's see Hugo from France, what he sent here. I haven't opened the package. I'll open up the, the package right now. I try to open from this side because on the other side uh, are some labels. And the package is open. Huh? Wow, we have a present here. Let's see what do we have here. <laughs> and we have a letter. Thank you, thank you very much, uh, Hugo. Uh, Hugo later is uh, thanking me about the knowledge he gathered from uh, from my channel. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. <laughs> Candies. Those looks nice. Come on, which one do you want? Huh? I will get this one. Mmm. Mmm. Crazy. Mmm. Mmm. Perfect. And what do we have here? Mmm. So good. And here, lol, chocolate bears. Check here. I mean, the people, I think they try to get me like diabetes. Lol, look, look how many chocolate bears are here. Jelly or marshmallow? Marshmallow? Huh? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I really have to visit France one day. But those fingies, hmm. 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 White chocolate. Hmm. Mm. Unbelievable. Mm. Hugo, thank you very much. It's really a nice surprise. Okay, let's start with a job and, uh, you know, get a pizza and then we can continue with the candies. So what do we have here? We have a nice HP laptop. Uh, a Dune and uh, Ryzen 7 CPU. Uh, this is coming from a local repair shop with... No power not coming on. Okay, good. Charger. Yeah, we have blue pin charger, so we can use like a blue pin charger. Let's plug a charger and see what he's doing. I mean, it's really, really nice, you know, when the people, uh, you know, they are sharing something, especially like this uh, gentleman, which he said he opened actually a repair shop based on the knowledge he got from YouTube. Now we have 19 volts, plug in the charger. And we have orange light, lol, and it's taking 180 milliamps. 180 milliamps, I'm assuming it's pre-charged current, right? Pressing the power button and the laptop is not coming on. It's taking 3.2 amps, good. Pressing the power button and it's not coming on, you can see, check there, nothing dead so why the laptop is not coming on the charging current is going down but still no no power nothing i mean we can't we cannot see like uh, the current that goes up when we are pressing the power button so i'm assuming the ecgp is not reading the power button but the ecgp is good because it is charging the battery yeah we can see the orange light, so it is speaking with the battery. 
Yeah, but the laptop is not coming on. For me, it looks like a frozen BIOS, but I'm not sure about that. Let's see. Or faulty keyboard. Yeah, can be, can be. Okay, so the back cover is removed. Yeah, that's a nice motherboard. So the charging current goes down to 2.7 amps. Uh, I'm pretty sure the, the current is going into the battery. The battery 12.8. Let's unplug the battery, let's see. Yeah, the current it is going into the battery. Good. So, the laptop is not coming on, right? No, it's not coming on. Let's try like a basic thing, like resetting the, the motherboard. So we unplug the battery. We don't have a BIOS battery. Good. So then let's plug the battery back. Let's plug the charger back and let's press the power button. No, it's still not working. Dead. Dead. And the laptop it's on, that's crazy. So actually it was a frozen bias. Lol. I can't believe actually I start a video for the for a frozen bias. Yeah, we have picture. Check here. That's crazy. <laughs> Enter restart. Easy pizza? Mm? Uh yeah, the current is kind of high. I'm assuming it's normal. And the laptop is charging and it's working normally. Yeah, it has touch screen. Frozen BIOS, you can believe that? Actually, it's frozen easy cheap. That was the problem. Was not reading the power button because it was charging fine. Insane fault. What can I say? Yeah, it is reading the power button. Anyway, if you have this laptop for repair, uh, let's uh, read the coils resistance. Maybe you will need uh, those resistance. So this one, nothing here, nothing here, nothing here, nothing. No, it is good. Here we have 122 ohms. I'm assuming it's the RAM memory uh, power supply. Here we have 3.7 ohms. Let me take out the heatsink because there are some coils under the heatsink. And also we can replace the thermal paste. So the heatsink is out. Yeah, definitely need a new thermal paste. So this coil has 3.3 ohms. This one 3.3 and this one 5.4 ohms. So if you have this motherboard for repair, now you know the coils resistance. Good, so we have a clean uh, CPU and heatsink. Just a little bit of thermal paste. Perfect. It is a strange job. It is because it's coming from a, a local repair shop. So, uh, you know, I was expecting... Uh, Already someone uh, to reset the board before uh, sending it here. Pressing the power button, we have to wait a little bit because we are resetting the BIOS every time we are unplugging the battery. Or need the charger. No, 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 the laptop is on, you can see it. Yeah, and the fans are spinning. Yeah, perfect, it's working. Enter. Yeah, all good. So I'm going to stop now. Uh, it was a pretty easy job. I can only wish uh, to have a lot of those kind of jobs. You know, just uh, we have a Novoton EC chip. You don't really see a lot of Novoton chips on those days. But anyway, thank you for watching. Hugo, thank you for the candies. Uh, it was a really a nice surprise. You know, just... Like, subscribe if you like the video, and see you on the next one. Bye. Hey.
If you find my content being helpful, don't forget you can support this channel by pressing the join button and you can get instantly access to our uh, members only cool collection and uh, Discord private channels for support with your repairs. Also, you can have a look on our uh, United Kingdom uh, eBay where you can find some cool and unique products, United States eBay store or our Patreon page. Thank you.